Whoa. And Squirrel Stampede is playing Minecraft. Whoa, what happened? I was just reviewing toys at the table and I switched that little tail on the wolf dog and then poof, I was like transported here. That's crazy and like completely not true. Um, here I am in the world of Minecraft and this is the worst place to spawn so I'm not going to use this level. What happened here? Oh look, there's even an ocean monument right there. But I'm like in the middle of nowhere on a little island, so let's uh, let's spawn somewhere else. Wow. And Squirrel Stampede is playing Minecraft. You already said that. Uh, here we are in a forest. I just spawned just right over there. Uh, probably should put like a marker or something. I always kind of want to do that, but like, you know, I don't know. How will I remember this is where I spawn? Um, somewhere in here. I guess it doesn't matter. Anyway, we gotta start cutting some trees down right away uh, or we're not gonna make it. Um, there's a lot of trees here. Anyhow, uh, introductions. My name is Dan, I run Squirrel Stampede and I have been doing toy reviews forever and I thought, hey, for the summer, why not we have a little fun and try playing some Minecraft, actually play some Minecraft so you can see how horrible uh, I am, what not to do in the game of Minecraft. Uh, so here we are on the first day. I'm playing just a basic survival mode game. I don't think it's on super hard. I don't think it's on super easy. It's just ready to go. And the first thing I'm doing here is gathering some wood. Hey, did you check that tree for squirrels? As I can when I'm starting out on these things. Here we go. Uh, so yeah, normally I'm doing toy reviews all the time, I thought. This summer it would be fun to do a little bit of a series of Minecraft gameplay. Um, at least uh, I'm thinking maybe six episodes to start with, maybe six to eight, we'll see. Uh, see how well it's received, how well you guys are just completely uh, disgusted by what I'm doing. Uh, just shocked and amazed, um, scared and all that. What is he doing? See now at this point in time, I could make myself a little crafting table already and uh, that would help me uh, chop this a little faster but I am using uh, Mac OS normally I use my Xbox one to play but this is so much easier for me to record and edit so I'm just gonna try on my Mac um, comfortable chair got my squirrel back there you know so I'm, I'm happy right here so we'll give it a shot um, but because I'm doing this on Mac OS I am a little bit rusty on some things. It's not exactly the same game you see on Xbox One and um, I'm using a, a Nimbus controller with the joystick mapper thing going and so I don't have all the controls that I need. I kind of have to switch back from controls to keyboard which is kind of a pain. Uh, so that's going to be a learning curve this summer as we go and if I can figure it out, if I can do any better, um, that sort of thing. So I think I've got enough wood here. Um, I always make the mistake of not getting enough wood. Looks like I've spawned in a forest region, which could be good or bad. I was hoping for extreme hills uh, biome, but so far I'm completely lost where I spawned in. I always want to put like a little marker where I just began for fun, but I see some land over there. I love to build on plateaus. Um, I've been playing Minecraft for maybe three-ish years now with um, just any kind of game, either creative mode or survival mode. Uh, sometimes playing with the kids, sometimes just kind of playing on my own. I've had a couple of really good world experiences, uh, but nothing I really can translate over here. Hey, i got some dogs over here, that's cool. It'd be really cool if I could find some sheep up first. Um, but so far, nothing. I really should be smashing some of these plants. As I go, see if I can get some seeds for a garden, but I think I'm coming up close to somewhere where I want to build. Oh good, so I might actually be near some uh, hill biome, which I definitely prefer. Oh, I see some pigs. This is, oh, my first sheep, two sheep, awesome. This is great, I can, oh, three sheep. I could possibly build a bed right off the bat. That's perfect. So let's see here, <laughs> sorry buddy. I should, um, oh, how, do, how many shots does it kill, do you take to kill a sheep without a weapon? Um, Learning that now, is that like eight? Did he just kill a sheep using seeds? Where'd he go? There he is. 
Sorry, buddy. I really need your wool. I don't want to sit up all night in a dark room talking to myself. I like to sleep at night. I've had too many games where I cannot find sheep for beds. Drives me nuts. So, I prefer playing survival mode most of the time. I think that's where it's fun. Um, creative mode is awesome, but like, it takes all the fun out of it sometimes. So that's kind of my thing. <laughs> all right, so we've got some wool. We've got to get hurrying already. I'm probably getting behind here. Um, next thing I need to figure out, oh, there's got to be some coal over there, but I think I'm going to um, maybe just use, well, I'm going to need to have some granite. Oh, there it is right there. So we are doing good. And I think I'm going to put my house just right here with all these llama. My first house. And now comes the fun part as I try to remember how to use this really ugly crafting guide. Um, let's see, something like this. And you can see my mouse or my uh, joystick here is a little bit slow on moving back and forth and that is just because that's the set speed I've got it going at so it's a little a little tricky I'm gonna have to hopefully figure out a better way to to work this as I go along so I'll drop that there uh, get some sticks or some tools oops I'm forgetting if I just keep clicking here I think I can get some multiple sticks and I need some tools where's the tools um, there we go. That takes a moment to get it going. I think an animal is getting tortured over Said there. something really quick here. You might want uh, something's on fire over here. What is going on? Oh, I'm building right next to lava. That's perfect. As long as it doesn't burn me down. Um, now I have somewhere to throw stuff I don't need. So that might work for good. Um, oh dear. I'm getting a little worried because I'm wasting a lot of time here. Um, I have got to get this house going. I've got a llama in my house. And hopefully we can get this going. Uh, you're going to have to move, buddy. So hopefully I'll eventually build like this giant squirrelopolis thing. I'd kind of like to do that. Okay, there's some tools. I just need my wood again. Um, oak planks, build some more oak planks, as many as I can, except for leaving a few for some torches. Oops, still not really comfortable doing this. Da, 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 da. So again, this is a huge work in progress. This is the first episode. I'm sure we'll look back and laugh at this. We'll be like, oh, oh, that's hideous. Oh, look what he did with, with the blocks. That's so weird and, and all that. Um, and so I will definitely appreciate any comments, critique, like, oh, you know, this was just hideous. Please do this. Um, please do that. Um, or do, you know, just give me suggestions. That would be great. And I'm definitely thinking about, you know, if this takes off, um, you guys are really enjoying it. I will, you know, build a little shout out wall or something with notes. And so everyone can kind of get involved. Uh, that would be awesome. I would like that a lot. And what else do I need? A shovel. A shovel here. Oops, I am so slow. Okay, getting better. Getting there. I want to get a few. I want to mine out some rock here real quick. I really would be cool to see some coal up here. That would just save my yak. Oh, there's some coal. Woohoo! That's going to save me a little bit. I might be able to survive this first night. I was really worried about this all day, like, if I do this and I can't survive the first night, that's going to be embarrassing. I don't want to have that on my conscience. I'll die, you know, plenty of times, I'm sure, but um, I don't want to look like the, the idiot who just died on the first night. Alright, the raptors would love it, I'm sure. They'd be like, oh, he's not intelligent enough to do this. Um, I say that I hopefully am. Oh, let's... Get some stone, too, so I can make some stone tools overnight. Not sure I'm going to use this area as my permanent residence. I'd like to find a nice flat area, too. I mean, I love the plateau building, so you can see your house from a distance. I think that's awesome. Um, I'm not sure yet. We'll explore. Uh, right now, this first uh, episode is all about just survival, just getting kind of something started, introduce myself again, 
uh, just kind of bore you to the point of never watching these again, right? So, okay, I think I got enough stone, right? I think that's enough stone. Two more, let's do two more. One more, one more. Okay, one more. It's gotta be getting dark really soon. Okay, I gotta hurry. At least I've got somewhat of a, of a house going here. I feel like I'm gonna be safe in here. Don't have to worry about building the bed yet. Really would like to get some torches going. And really would like to get at least four, four walls going here. Um, that makes me feel a little safer. And okay, so what do I need to make now? Uh, oh, there's so many things to do. Uh, pickaxe, yeah, I'll do that. Starting to get a little bit flustered about what I need to do, I think. I was playing this the other day and for some reason the Mac doesn't update torches um, automatically. It was driving me nuts. So I had to do the crafting guide for it. And so yeah. Woohoo, we've got light. That is the most important thing in trying to survive here. So we don't have any uglies come up and surprise us. It's already way too late for this. Um, let's go inside. I'm just gonna do this for now. And one more over here. Oh dear, this is scary. I don't think they can get in at this height, can they? Can I make a bed? Yes, I can make a bed. I think I've survived the first night. Woohoo! I shouldn't say that until I do. Um, can I get a bed down, please? There we go. Can I go to bed without getting killed? I did it! Squirrel Stampede has survived the first night, and I bet you guys didn't even think I could survive the first five minutes. Woo! That's a lot of stress off my head. I made it the first night. I didn't think that was gonna happen, but here we go. We have survived. Look at this cheesy little house I built. Uh, let's get some uh, stone tools first so that I can, oh, I guess, what do I need? I need some more sticks first. So let's find some sticks. Um, or do I need more wood? What do I need? What is going on here? I think I need more wood. No, I've got plenty of wood. Since I don't, since I have coal, I should say, I don't really need to um, save all my wood. So go like that. And now I need some sticks. Where are the sticks? Still trying to figure out this menu. It's really kind of not as cool as the Xbox. These controls are really cheesy. Look how slow that mouse goes. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna have to bump that up just a little bit. The problem is if I bump it up too much, then when I'm back in this mode, I'm like flying around. But actually that's kind of slow. Watch how I'm moving back and forth. I think I could bump that up. So that's gonna be something I do on episode two. Are you excited about that? Oh, Squirrel Stampede's figuring out basic controls. Wow, he's so old. Um, okay, there's an ax, stone ax. And oh yeah, I gotta get that garden going really soon. So I'm gonna get a stone hoe made. And let's get a door. I'm gonna have to have a door in this house. So that's good to have. And anything else pressing? I don't think so. So let's bash out a door here. Let's see, my bed's on this side, so I'll just put the door over here on this side. Boom. Boom, good morning llamas. And we'll put this here. And now we're good. We're good to go. We go in and out of the homestead. I love it. I can't believe I was able to pull this off. I'm not so sure about that. While recording, it was just gonna be like complete, complete mess. Right now I'm just checking to see if there's any seeds in there. Uh, quick question for you super Minecrafters. Uh, if you use a tool, while hitting your grass, are you more likely to get seeds? I don't know that. I still haven't tried. To, still haven't really noticed if I'm dropping any more seeds by doing that. So if you know, that would be cool. I mean, please, again, feel free to let me know what I am doing wrong because technically I should call this how not to play Minecraft. Um, let's work on my house a little more, get it a little bit bigger. I'm gonna need another row here and doo -doo -doo. 
Am I out of wood? I am out of wood. Looks like I'm gonna be chopping, going to need to chop some more wood. Um, let's get that. Let's get a couple more torches first in the area. I like to at least light up a little bit of where I am so I'm not like completely lost at night. And this is a really good spawning area when I started today. I actually started, before I started on the island today, that was awful, I actually spawned in like a desert region with a village and a sand uh, monument thingy right next to me. It was crazy, but I felt like it was just too much. Like I would be going to the village and like, can I have your vegetables? And just, you know, just completely mooching off them. I really wanted to be able to uh, do this without any, any sort of crutch. So that's kind of where I'm at with that. And then I, then I did the island where I'm like in the middle of nowhere, like, oh boy, that's gonna be exciting, watching me like barely survive off crumbs for like three months, or well, I guess I could have swam across the ocean, but it just would have been really ugly, I think. Would have been a really difficult game to go with. So now, at least with this game, I feel, I feel pretty good that we can entertain for a few episodes this summer. I'm thinking about like Wednesdays, um, releasing these usually on a Wednesday. So I'd probably do like a toy review on Monday-ish and then a Minecraft run through on Wednesday and then Friday, Saturday, I would have a couple more toy reviews. Um, we will see how that goes, um, if I'm too busy or not. Um, it's kind of neat to be able to do this because I think, I think once I get the hang of recording and playing and figuring out what I'm doing for each day, um, it'll be a little easier to, to kind of set up because it does take a lot of time to set up a toy review. Um, I'm a little bit, a little, I do, I kind of overkill these days. I just kind of, I do way too much editing. Um, and so hopefully this will be a quicker edit and then we'll be able to just do that without losing content. <laughs> he thinks he does all the editing work only raptors have the intelligence to do the fine editing DNA. Oh, I needed to build a shovel. Did I build a shovel? Uh, I did. I did build a shovel. I'm gonna have to come up with a better trail system. Um, not that one. This one, this one. I hope I'm climbing the right mountain. Okay, I think it's over here. My house is over here. There it is. Okay. Woohoo! I made it. Made it back to the homestead. Everything's looking good. And so we can make a few more things. I'm pretty much out of time, I think. So I'm so excited to do this and it's crazy that we're doing this now. And I hope you watch and continue to watch this craziness. I, what I may do is I would like to put, you know, 90% of the important stuff on, on these episodes. Um, but if I may in between, like do a few things to catch up here and there and and look around and then I'll I'll take you back to where I was uh, just so I'm not like boring everybody because that's I don't want that to happen so with that uh, I think it's gonna be a lot of fun it's gonna be a lot of fun this summer so thank you for watching episode one I have managed to build most of my uh, first house here where's that maybe I should just finish off this wall so that you feel like oh he's he's gonna be safe and then we'll fix the roof line next time but right now I've got four walls that is awesome I'm safe inside my house let's make another little decorative log here if I can do I have any more of those logs yeah make it decorative eventually I'd like to make a squirrelopolis you know giant squirrels that'd be great we'll get there though we'll get there so that is me playing Minecraft after all these years of toy reviews and saying, oh, I know something about Minecraft, yeah, yeah. Um, now we get to actually test that. So that is what you're gonna see. Thanks for watching. This is going to be a long, 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 long summer. Can you build me a bed in episode two to sleep through the video? Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please like, share, Subscribe.